Welcome to Prepared Leaders, where we'll teach you the secret formula you have been missing when it comes to self-improvement, and some leadership tips that will help you climb the ladder of success. In this video, I'll go over the three techniques to improve your communication skills, as well as the value of listening in conversation. Do you know the one secret to mastering conversation? The secret is to think before you speak. It's always polite to take a 3-5 to five second pause when someone finishes speaking in a conversation. When you pause, you simultaneously achieve three objectives. First, if the other person is simply taking a breath before it's resuming, you want to avoid the risk of interrupting. The second benefit is that you show the other person that you are paying carefully regard to his or her statements, but not rushing in with your own opinions at the first chance. The third advantage of pausing during a discussion is that you'll truly hear the other person better since their words will sink into a deeper level of your mind and you'll be able to more clearly understand what they're really saying. You'll distinguish yourself as a master conversationalist by pausing. Asking for clarification is another approach to improving your communicational skills. Never take the other person's words or intentions for granted. Instead, if you are unsure of anything, ask how they mean or what they mean specifically. Simply pause and wait after that. The best question I've ever learned for directing and managing a conversation is this one. When you inquire as to what you mean, it is nearly impossible for the other person to avoid responding with a more detailed explanation. After then, you can ask more in-depth questions to continue the dialogue. The third approach to improving your conversational skills is to rephrase the other person's words. Thus, after smiling and nodding, you can say, Well, let me check if I've got this right. Please confirm that I understand you correctly before you repeat what you just said in your own words by paraphrasing the speaker. When you practice excellent listening, the amazing thing is that you express without a doubt that you are sincerely paying attention and making every attempt to grasp his or her thoughts or feelings. Soon, you'll start to fascinate others because you'll listen to other people. You give them a sense of importance. As a result, they will want to be around you. They will feel at ease and happy in your presence. Effective communication means being able to listen carefully and explain yourself clearly to the people around you. Unfortunately, there isn't just one ability or method that will help you communicate better. For effective communication, you need to be able to listen carefully and pick up the both nonverbal and verbal cues. Effective communication is important both in and out of the office because it lets you translate your goals and feelings into signals that are easy to understand. Effective communication makes you a more productive worker and makes it less likely that things will go wrong. Having a good way to communicate makes it easier to understand what other people are saying and to work with them as part of a team. And before we continue, I'll be giving you time to subscribe to the channel, hit the like button and turn on the notification bell to be notified every time a new video is uploaded. And let's continue. We frequently take listening for granted. People frequently hear what is being said, yet hearing and listening are very different. When we listen, we must intentionally work to absorb, understand, and not just hear what others are saying. In addition to improving your comprehension and communication skills, active listening makes it more pleasant for other people to speak with you. One of the fundamental soft talents is listening. It reveals a person's capacity for information reception and interpretation during communication. Without the ability to actively listen, you won't be able to understand what is being said. As a result, there will be a breakdown in communication, and the speaker may grow agitated very quickly. The ability to listen is a key component of effective communication. If you know how to talk to people well, you can start to improve your personal and professional relationships. 
You can tell that you're curious and interested in people and events when you listen attentively to others. Also, being able to understand what you hear can help you become more knowledgeable and kind. When you listen well to other people, you start to notice more of the aesthetic parts of how they build arguments and present information. As a result, you are able to evaluate what you believe works and doesn't work in other people's presentations, which might aid you in changing your own speeches. For instance, paying close attention to how other people cite sources orally while they are speaking might help you come up with creative ways to mention sources in your own presentation. Why do we sometimes not listen? Various events in our own lives or negative habits we may have developed may have an impact on our capacity to listen effectively. Now more than ever, it is simple to get sidetracked by something or even just our own thoughts, which causes us to lose interest in what is being stated. Some of the reasons we don't listen attentively include being preoccupied with our own thoughts, being preoccupied with something, we already have a response prepared, something that goes against what we believe. What makes listening crucial? Listening is an important part of communication, and there are differences between passive listening and active listening in many areas of our lives and growth. By actively listening, you can gain knowledge and comprehension in a social and professional setting, improve your social skills, better express sympathy to friends and relatives, strengthen relationships by instilling a sense of importance in others, develop problem-solving abilities, and improve knowledge retention. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Make sure to give this video a big thumbs up and turn on the notification bell so you'll know when I upload new content. Leave a comment down below if you have any questions. Be sure to subscribe if you haven't yet and I'll see you all in my next video.